I have returned, and so has Donkey Kong in Donkey Kong Country Returns. With another installment of Donkey Kong Country Returns. I don't know why I said that, but I did. What are you gonna do about it? Nothing. So, back here in the factory. Music badness, anything can happen. Just gonna equip a heart boost to be safe. And just... Right off the bat, we're going to start off... 7-7. Seven, seven. Music Madness. Uh, as you may already be able to tell, this is going to be a... Oh yeah, find the button. Better find it. But this is going to be a rhythm-based puzzle thing. Okay. And this is really weird. Like, you go in here, and then you're, like, zoomed in. Yeah, it's it's just... It's a whole thing. So yes, these drums, if you can hear the music, which I cannot, because if I did, then the music would echo. So I'm just gonna have to rely on sight, but every time like the music ow <laughs> I even was next to it too. So every time the music was like Psh, something like that is going to happen. Oh my gosh, I'm just gonna go down here to save myself. Okay. Go in there to get the end. Wait, was that the end? No, it was the kick. Why did I think it was the end? Who knows? Uh this is actually timing too. This music is really weird, like I know it's a rhythm based puzzle thing, but still, it sounds like creepy. Ugh. And because I'm mean, I'm going to try to kill this guy. Didn't work. But the rooster still exploded, which is always very comical, of course. And it looks like a very giant screwdriver. I don't know about you guys. That's what it looks like to me. Oh my gosh, fire! So yes, we can actually kill these guys now that we have. Exploding chickens. Oh my gosh. Calm down, Diddy Kong. Uh, you can get every one of these bananas if you really want to. Please don't. Just get the puzzle piece. And be on your way. And don't die, that would help. Oh, let's try it this time. Awesome. So yes, you need to stun him and then pound on that to get the item. Oh, this is hard. Ah! Okay, I got it. Don't worry, guys. I got it. Exploding chicken powers activate! Uh-huh. Uh, just before I forget, let me get the end. And then I think there is something down here. Oh, yes, there is. Oh my gosh, it's really weird because these jumps go in the, s in the wrong dimension, of course. So if you're anywhere near them when they hit, like in their line of hitting, you get hit anyways. It it's it's just weird. So yes, this is really weird. Uh, the water actually doesn't hurt you. Uh, it's not water, it's air. just blows you up like that. It actually helps you later on. Fire does hurt you though. So be on the lookout for that. Oh, go down. <laughs> Jeez, flamethrowers in a factory? That's not safe. Uh, oh, there's something down here. De Why is that floating right above me? Why can't it just fall to earth like a normal thing? Jeez. Okay, let's go down here. I don't know why I delayed that longer than I should have. Uh, this is the button, though. And the golden colored rust button will be activated. Yes! Power! Coursing through my veins! Yeah, okay. Not that exciting, I guess, because we already got two of them. Still pretty cool, though. You know, just the satisfaction of plugging in a giant electrical socket. It just can't be beat. Uh, let's see. This looks actually kind of hard. I'm gonna go down here. Oh, yes, I do. Uh, well, maybe not. Okay, <laughs> never mind. That was a waste of time, and now they're gonna be more frequent. So you always wanna look out for a pattern to not die. Because, you know, living is always good. Uh, this. Prepare for you guys. Prepare yourself. Boom! Giant hammer! And see, see? I, it didn't even crush me, but because I was in its line when it did that whole thingy, my job. Did I say my job? I did miss it. Basically, yeah, I'm not even pressing anything. I just blast you high into the air. Nothing you can do about it. 
but why would you want to stop this? Just so cool. I love when the camera zooms out like this in this game. Yes. I think you can really control what you get there, but we got all the Florida Kong letters. I don't even know how many puzzle pieces there were. I'm sure we didn't get all of them. Uh, I think I don't need to walk through this, guys, so I'll be right back with that puzzle piece momentarily and deal with this music for that much longer. Oh my goodness. Okay, yeah, that, I'm thinking it's on top of one of these things. So I'm gonna time it just right. To be on top, yes! Uh, oh, I was right! Yes! See, they, they make you think, which is terrible, first of all, but because you can't see that barrel until you're actually up there. Who would think to go up there? Uh, obviously not me, it seems. Nice background though, I like that. Oh, one banana. Where have I seen this before? Ugh. So, like all adventures end with suicide. A very glitchy suicide, but nonetheless, suicide. Uh, that was bad timing, and more suicide. Cut to the puzzle piece. Oh yeah, anti-gravity Dom Kong. If he had kept going with lots of physics, he would have fallen to his doom. But of course, cutscenes save us all, even though I always seem to get hurt in cutscenes. When I shouldn't be able to. Anyways, ow, just killed my only chance. I'll meet you at the end. Else I die, which is bound to happen, so don't listen to me, just watch the video. I already said this. See? 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 What did I tell you? I'm not even gonna respond to that. Didn't happen. Only Diddy Kong were here to save me. Luckily, there's like 10 checkpoints here. So, not to worry. Okay, start worrying, guys. Did I just do the same thing three times? I did, didn't I? Yep. Four times? Can I hit five? Let's find out. No, we did not hit five. Instead, we hit seven. Did not expect TK there. I missed the end. Who cares? In fact, when you think about it, why are there like floating letters just hanging about? I don't know. But as you can see, those three red buttons are actually required to get the space rocket. Oh my gosh. And the temple. Uh, I don't know if you saw this, but this just made a loop back around here. Uh, I don't know why they did that. Seems pretty useless. I almost said full. Anyways, this 7R, I'm not going to include it on the sidebar. It's not a real level. No collectibles. It's just to get you to the boss. You have to do it. It's really fun, though. You know, just get some bananas to get to the boss. And you need to take a rocket to the boss somehow. The factory is also outer space themed. You know they have to include that theme somewhere in this game. Oh, it looks so cool. I don't know what it is, but it looks cool. It's like a swirling circle of desire and destiny. Yeah, it's probably just like a television display, but I like my destiny idea for. Uh, very little known fact, there's actually this thing here you can get. Uh, I don't know who cares. But, we go into the rocket, oh, it's so awesome, but no, they can't give us the real rocket, they just have to put us in this stupid rocket barrel, no one cares about it. Uh, if you actually press A here, 
this mechanic will come into play one more time in the future. But, you know, since it's not side scrolling anymore, pressing A makes you go faster, and not pressing it makes you go slow. All I have to do is steer, really. Ah! Ah! Easier said than done! I actually die on that. I am surprised. And shocked. Okay, let's start that over again. Why is Pig telling me how to do this? I already know how to do this. I think the camera scrolls at a regular level, though. Like, this doesn't really make you go faster through level. It just makes, I guess, you closer to the top of the screen, if that makes you feel better. So I was going to stay around the middle in case you need to fall back in tricky situations. Such as this. Ah. Okay. Let's make it. Yes. And now we are up. There's the real Boralus. And I died. Yeah, I forgot that those ships actually hurt you. Thought they were part of the background. I was wrong. And I missed my flight. Yahoo! Okay, I roll. Oh my gosh. Northern Lights back again. Uh, don't hit these ships. Ah. It was actually kind of hard. And now past the sky and the moon, apparently. Very cool moon, by the way. Oh, bananas, Josh. Why are they just giving us the, our, their bananas? Like, hasn't that been the whole plot of the game to get back our bananas? And they're just handing it to us? They're like, oh, I give up. Who cares? But yes, when we go off into space, it somehow creates a path to the boss feather fiend. For that, though, we are going to do the temple. Which is called Dramatic Suspense Treacherous Track. You know what that means. It means heart boost. Uh, probably should have had Diddy Kong. Not gonna complain about it though. I think I'm good enough at this game to do it without Diddy Kong. Not entirely sure though. Oh, I remember this. Okay. In Donkey Kong, this is actually pretty hard. Donkey Kong Country, there's some of these segments, and Donkey Kong Country 2 and 3, you know, what have you. Some of these segments where you have to grab fuel for your minecart or something like that. Uh, this is kind of like that, except hitting these switches makes the rail activate. Miss that. Gonna die. Oh, goodness. Oh, these are exploding. Oh, oh my gosh. Can I survive? Did that guy just, like, fade into the background? Is that fair? Don't think so. Oh, they actually give you a DK barrel in this. Oh my gosh. That's cool. I did not even know that. Wow. I, I thought temples never give you DK barrels. So cool. Being so nice. No, it's probably just going to be hard. And we're going to need it. Uh, why do I keep grabbing the power-up? Good hint. Don't grab power-ups because I think there's actually none of the... Oh my gosh, puzzle pieces are in pots. I may be wrong, but I'll be back at that puzzle piece when I get it. That wasn't so hard. Now, what is it? Oh, you want timer jumps here? You wanna get too far ahead of yourself? Again, stop grabbing your hands. Okay, puzzle piece on there. I don't know why I wasted time up there. So I already told you there wasn't anything special. Oh, I think I'm getting behind. I don't know. And boom! Oh, well, I'm actually doing pretty well. Watch, I'm just gonna die. Again, I used to be really good at this, not because I did really well, but because I died so many times that I memorized the track. Seems like that is going to happen again. Oh, look at that oasis. It looks so cool. Uh, meet you back at that puzzle piece. Hopefully. Oh, I just sealed my doom! Oh, there goes my doom. Star doom. Oh my gosh, maybe I should just cut from this beautiful waste every single time. It's so cool, though. There it is. Four out of five. Feeling pretty good about this. Don't want to miss one, though. This level is pretty fun, but it is also kind of long and monotonous and stuff and it's gonna get harder so oh goodness okay <laughs> that worked out better than I thought it would 
Ah! Don't jinx, don't jinx, don't jinx! I'm jinxing! Ah. Okay, I'm safe. Uh, not entirely. Oh, goodness. Oh, no! I was so close. So close, so far. Cut at the oasis. And go. No, I died. Uh, cut to oasis! Okay, there's no puzzle pieces left. Just book it. Just book it. Uh, full hearts, I don't care. Just book it. <gasps> and we come to the end of the treasure's trap. Please don't fall. Okay, I don't want to die. And the final orb is none other than the crystal orb. I mean the seventh orb. Don't know why I said final. But who cares? Uh, I just realized that I accidentally did three levels in one episode. Sorry about that, I lost track of time. Doing this is so fun. So I guess we're just gonna do Feather Fiend in the next episode. You heard me right, the next episode. Uh, so this has been Real to Cliff, I thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this episode. Don't go get returns, and the special liftoff launch can be replayed till... I don't know, till the world ends, or you just lose your game, whatever, what have you, so I thank you for watching, and may your free bananas return, good night everybody.